Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer software testing interview question 182. That is, who is a Scrum Master? Let me answer. Scrum Master is a role in Agile Scrum methodology following projects. Okay, Scrum Master is a role in Agile Scrum methodology following projects who make sure Scrum framework is followed throughout the project. Okay. This role in Agile Scrum methodology following projects will make sure whether the Scrum framework is being followed throughout the project or not. That is what is a Scrum Master. Scrum Master has several responsibilities. What are the different responsibilities of the Scrum Master? Let me explain one by one. First of all, the Scrum Master will guide and coach the Scrum team on Scrum framework. If the Scrum team is lagging in Scrum framework, then who will guide you or coach you? The Scrum Master will guide you or coach you. And Scrum Master not only guides and coaches you, but also removes the blockers so that the work continues. If due to some XYZ reasons in the project, in Agile Scrum methodology following projects, if a work stops due to a particular blocker or something, then whose responsibility is to remove that blocker or resolve that blocker for the team? Scrum Master. Okay, Scrum Master will look into the blocker and will make sure the blocker gets resolved by taking so and so actions and Make sure that the work continues in the project. Okay, work doesn't stop in the project. That's what is a scrum master and scrum master will attend uh, meetings and conducts few meetings. So scrum master conducts daily stand up meeting or daily scrum meeting. Okay, to track the progress of the work. So scrum master will conduct a meeting known as daily scrum meeting at same time at same place for 15 minutes every day. Okay, throughout the sprint and uh, in that particular meeting the scrum master will check with each and every Scrum team member uh, to see where they are standing, like uh, what is the work they have completed, what is the work that they are currently doing, what is the work that they are going to plan to do tomorrow. Okay, are there any blockers while they are working on this? All these things will be discussed by the Scrum Master in that Scrum meetings, that is daily Scrum meeting or daily stand up meeting, whatever you can call. Fine. Not only that, guys, Scrum Master will also conduct a retrospective meeting, sprint retrospective meeting. At the end of every sprint, okay. As we already know in Agile Scrum methodology following projects, the work will happen in iterations, iteration one, iteration two, and so on. Each and every iteration is known as a sprint. So after the sprint work is completed, before the next sprint work starts, in between, a meeting will be conducted by Scrum Master known as a sprint retrospective meeting, where everyone will attend in this meeting to discuss what went well in the previous sprint, what didn't went well, what are the improvements that we can make for the next sprint so that uh, we can do better work. All such kind of things will be discussed in the sprint retrospective meeting for that who will conduct that meeting. Scrum Master will conduct that meeting. Not only conducting the meeting, Scrum Master will make a note of the action items okay, that the team has suggested or discussed during that retrospective meeting like the areas of improvement and so on for the next sprint. Okay, All this will be, uh, all this feedback or notes, uh, action item notes will be taken by the Scrum Master, okay, and next one. Scrum Master will also attend the sprint planning meeting, okay. Before the product backlog items are assigned to the sprint backlog, okay, a planning meeting will be conducted by the product owner, right? That is called a sprint planning meeting. So Scrum Master will also attend this uh, sprint planning meeting, and uh, the Scrum Master will protect the team from overcommitting. Sometimes product owner will give more work, and team should not accept, okay. So team should reject it. So if the team is unable to reject it, maybe the Scrum Master will give you the hints in that meeting like, okay, uh, I think it looks like this is a kind of more work. Uh, are you sure that you can do it or something like such kind of questions will be posted by Scrum Master in that uh, sprint planning meeting so that the team will cross check again and uh, see whether they are over committing or not. Okay. And also not only that guys, Scrum Master will help the team in estimation in doing the story estimations for each and every stories in the sprint planning meeting and subtask creation for those stories. All these things Scrum Master will help and aid. Okay, so this is coming to the meetings. What is the roles and ro role and responsibility of the Scrum Master as part of meetings, different meetings. Then Scrum Master will look into the Jira tool every day. Okay, so what uh, are, the Scrum Master will administer the Jira tool. That means uh, whether the uh, stories are being picked properly by the developers and testers while they are working on the sprints. They are putting the proper comments or not. They are doing the uh, respective action, actions at proper time or not. All these things will be administered by the Scrum Master. If a team doesn't follow that that process, then Scrum Master will guide and coach the team okay, to follow that direction. 
then reporting coming to the reporting guys nowadays most of the reporting is done by the tools like jira tool and all will do the reporting but uh, without jira tool also if the scrum master has to work the scrum master has to create a burn down chart by himself or herself okay scrum master has to create and use the uh, uh, velocity charts to see what is the speed of the teams okay while working and all okay all these different type of reports will be created by the scrum master if not uh, the scrum master will use the jira tool uh, to check the auto generated tools and this this reports will be again used in the projects to see where the project is standing and all then coming to the team support okay so coming to the team guys sometimes what happens during in the teams is like uh, uh, within the team some disputes may happen or some disagreements will happen between the different people okay who are working together so scrum master is the one who has to resolve okay these disputes and disagreements in the team so that the project runs smooth then scrum master not only resolves these disputes and disagreements but also protects the scrum team from external deviations and overburdening man overburdening managers sometimes uh, in some projects some managers may be there who will try to uh, encase the situation like uh, take utilization of the situation by overburdening over the resources and by giving some extra work and all the scrum master is the one who will uh, protect the scrum team at that time by you know right uh, protecting the team from that kind of managers by uh, keeping the things straight and uh, making the exact work being uh, given or assigned to the uh, scrum team okay so all these kind of activities are done by the scrum master guys these are the different responsibilities of the scrum master and many more may be there these are the important ones that i covered in this session whatever you remember you just try to answer in the interview okay you get the same interview question uh, you can just answer that a scrum master is a role in agile scrum methodology following projects who makes sure the scrum framework is being followed throughout the project and whose roles and roles and responsibilities are this whatever you remember those roles and responsibilities you can mention in the interview question so that's all for this session in the next session, I'm going to answer another software testing interview question for you. Till then, see you. Bye-bye.